What's up, YouTube? What you know? My name is Domino with the Zero, and welcome back to Pokemon Mystery Dungeon Blue and Red Rescue Team with Neighbor. Say hello. Hello. In the last episode, we took on Skarmory in the first big boss battle where we saved Diglett. Um, if you do want to go back and check that out, click the icon up at the top of the screen. In today's episode... Today's episode, uh, since we left off last episode wanting Magnemite to join our squad, they weren't able to do that because we didn't have any friend areas. So in this episode, now that Wigglytuff is back in business, we can buy some friend areas, start recruiting some new members to the Domination. And if you want to be a part of the Domination, just like these Pokemon that might be joining our squad, you should hit the subscribe button. That way you get to know whenever new content's coming out. You can check out these new episodes in your sub boxes every Tuesday, uh, Thursday, and Saturday, mm -hmm. as well as all the other wonderful content on this channel. And go ahead and hit that like button as well. Let us know if you like this kind of content. There you go. Uh, and also, make sure you check out, uh, I think the video might have gone up yesterday, that'd be Monday, talking about a charity live stream that we're going to be doing, or a couple days of charity live stream. You can check out that video so you can join us on that to raise some money for a pretty good cause. Um, so let's go ahead and jump in where I think we're just going to be running out. We're heading out. Okay, we're heading out. We're heading out. Now, you said something about a name. Yeah, so... The, the best, we, we have Dominator. Right, and Dominator. And we have, we have a Totemander as a, as a wonderful combination name. Yes. I feel like we got stuck on TJ and Olive. The best possible name is OJ. 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 Is that orange juice? Oh, yes. All right. Works for me. <laughs> so, morning, Dominator. Uh, what's the matter? You haven't woken up yet? Oh, you've been having strange dreams. What was strange about them? Well, there was a Gardevoir involved. There was a Gardevoir in there somewhere. Hmm, okay. Dominator, you said you're actually a human, right? So maybe those dreams have some connection to how you became a Pokemon. By the way, what do you want to do? Do you want to turn back into a human? Mm, it's true. I haven't thought about it much, but... Do I want to become a human again? You know, I was just thinking about this. And... Don't ask how I was just thinking about this, but... Uh, being a human right now, especially in America, isn't the best thing. I think I would la rather stay a Pokemon. So I'm, I'm not sure. <laughs> I'm yeah. not very sure. Are you very sure? I don't know what I was like as a human. All I know is I was a human. I don't know if I was a terrible person. I don't know what I was. That, that's. I know how I am now. I guess that's... And, and what are you now? I'm a Totodile. You're a Totodile. <laughs> I'm not sure. I'm not sure either. Oh, uh, what's wrong? Is this a dilemma for you? Oh, well, I hope not. What? I hope so. What? I'm sure it must... It sure, it sure must be more fun to be here with me. Anyway, we're supposed to go to Pokemon Square today. You remember? We need to get information on how we can add members to the rescue team. Let's get going. Boy. Now, I think we have a question of the day. Yes. But are we gonna... I think we'll save it for we'll a little save bit. It for we'll a save little it for a little bit. You can probably so, see it up there if you want to. No, you can't see it just yet. Oh. Can oh. you can you not spoil the layouts as they come? Okay. Anyway, are we gonna do everything else first? Uh, step one, I looked at my inventory a little bit and realized that it is extra full. Store. All right, so let's let's throw this stuff up now. When are we gonna like? When when do, do, are we going somewhere again? Are we going to? Uh, we'll we'll be going somewhere this episode for sure. Okay. So I'm just gonna. Oh, Load yeah. up on regular All amount of things. Of I'm gonna Wait. keep that Petra scarf. I forgot that I earned a Petra scarf. I'm gonna, I gotta oh. remember to equip that. It opened me on. Uh, it opened me on Toolbox B. That yeah. threw me off. All right, I don't need, uh, I don't need six Oran berries. We're not at the end of the game just yet. Right. Uh, Let me see. What else? What else? Okay, that's that. That should be fine. I only Do have, I have one have apple, a, but... I, I, I don't think I have any apples, so I'm going to see if I can take some of those out of storage. I'm going to take two apples out of storage if I have them. Uh, they're selling some apples, some big apples. They are selling that Reviver Seed I still. I have nine apples. Is there a way to pick more than one at a time? Nope. I guarantee you there is, and I'm just a big dummy. I mean, I don't know how to do it. All right, um, what else? What else do we need to do? I guess we're just waiting to talk to Wigglytuff. <gasps> Wigglytuff! Do take out more than one. Okay, I'm on my way. I'm running. I'm running. I'm running. I'm running. Uh, you got a Wigglytuff? You want me to get a Wigglytuff? 
I think you should do Wigglytuff. <clears throat> Who is Wigglytuff gonna be? Tough. Wigglytuff is- Friends are my treasures! Welcome to Wigglytuff Club! A circle of friends! Oh? Is this your first visit here? Oh, I get it. You don't like me. You don't like being around people like me. You're just <laughs> judging me, so you didn't want to come here before. You started a rescue team? Whatever. You come to the right place. I sell friend areas to add members to your rescue team. You know, ain't gonna ask me though. Since you're here for the very first time, I'll give you two friend areas for free, I guess. Let's do it. Wiggly tough, wiggly tough. Let's be friends. Ah! <laughs> ah! You can go to the Wild Plains now. Congratulations! You can go to the Wild Plains now! You can also go to the Mist Rise Forest. Ooh, that, that is an ominous sounding friend yes. area. Now you can recruit Pokemon that live in these two friend areas. How do you recruit new members? Well, if you're fighting Pokemon that live in a friend area, sometimes they will come to admire you as a friend. In that case, they might ask you to join your team. Just keep trying. Oh, it's time now. It's time. One thing that I've it's time. learned. If you're giving friend areas away, can you also give my friends access to the power plant friend area? I also want to join their rescue team. Okay, gotcha. But but they didn't want they didn't ask me before. Apparently they asked you before. So whatever, I'm giving it away today. Wiggly tough, wiggly tough. Let's be friends. Ah! Like what is that? <laughs> is that wiggly tough like hitting something? It's ah! definitely like slamming the desk. Ah! <laughs> right, right. I swear that desk is about to be smacked in half. Right, right. Brick break. Congratulations! You can go to the power plant now. Yes! Now I can join their team! Yay! Boo, boo, boo! Sorry! I know my friends turned down your offer to join your team yesterday. But after mulling it over last night, my friend developed an overwhelming desire to become your team member. I apologize, but could you allow my friend to join your rescue team? Don't give me the option, because I know what I'm telling him. <laughs> oh, wow. Don't forget, we're the ones that ask your friend to join us. So, since he turned us down once, he obviously doesn't want to be on the team, so the answer is no. <laughs> All right, good on you. Boo, boo, boo. <laughs> Do your best and try not to hinder your rescue teammates! Bzz, bzz, bzz. You ain't gotta worry about that because you ain't gonna be on the team. Yeah, I'll do my best! From the friend area! Bzz, bzz. That's right! I guess it could have been a Bagon! Ooh, a nickname? What the? Okay, a uh, nickname, a nickname. Magnemite, you are called. I don't want to name him Izzy. For, uh... For, All right, you name yours Izzy. Mine for is going reasons to be apparent uh, to me. <laughs> because Tentamon's name is Tentamon. I can't name Tentamon. Okay, um, I, I'm terrible at nicknames. He's gonna be named. I think. I'm gonna call him Bench. <clears throat> I don't know why, but he's gonna be on the bench because I'm never gonna use him. I'll be resting up in the power plant friend area. If you want me along for a rescue, come get me at the power plant. Okay, bzz, bzz, bzz. You can go to your friend areas by taking the left class from pet path from your rescue team base. There's a sign on the path to the left of your rescue team base, so you shouldn't have any trouble. That's all the giveaways today. If you want more fair in areas, you'll have to buy them now. The so first thing I'm gonna do is take money out of my bank. Wait. What, uh, what do you buy? What do you want to buy here? Friend areas. There's I don't so know. many of them. Exactly. Like so I think <clears throat> the way I have to think about it is these Pokemon that we run into are only as exciting as they are right now. There's no potential meter for later for the main story that lasts a little bit. Uh -huh. So if I run into a Beldum, I'm not super stoked to add a Beldum to my team. They're going to know take down, be hurting themselves and being useless for 50 levels. Okay. And even... Spoiler alert, even after post-game, there's going to be a lot of grinding before they become anything good. Okay. So, I'm thinking, what Pokemon is cool right now? And right now, I have no idea. The Peanut Swamp is expensive. But I do see a couple of really cheap ones. So I'm just going to go through and buy some cheap ones. If right. Mount Deep Greens, buying it. I don't know what goes there, but Yamata! 
she actually said, Yamata! Yamata! <laughs> I didn't actually mean to hit this. Anyway, uh, um, the bow planes. Bow. That one's 600. The next cheapest one is the Mushroom Forest, but I'm trying to think about what Transform Forest sounds cool. I don't know what I run into in Transform Can Forest. Can I get a Mew? I don't want to find it. Okay, well, you're doing Transform Forest. I'm going to do the Rub-A-Dub River. Ooh, the Rub-A-Dub River. That's what I'm talking about. You don't have a water type on your squad, That's so that'd exactly be perfect. I got a water That's type on exactly Rub-A-Dub River. That's exactly what I'm saying. I don't know why I did that first one. I think I did the first one because it was 130. Yeah, exactly. All right. Um, cheap. Ooh. I, I'm gonna buy one more, and I'm gonna buy it. Which one are you doing? I'm gonna buy Mount Discipline, because if I'm not wrong, I think Mount Discipline A is gonna give me some disciplined Pokemon. Right, right. And I think they're gonna be primarily fighting types. Fighting or psychic, I think, is what it could be. So I think that would be a cool Pokemon to add to my squad. I'm going for Mount Discipline, and then we can save the rest of my money for later when I maybe have an idea of where a Pokemon's gonna be. I'm gonna go for the magnetic query Ooh. to try and get an electric type. Electric type you like a little bit better than uh. All right, I'm gonna go with that. Bzz, bzz. I didn't get him. <laughs> All right, so now what? Are we just supposed to be doing missions? Yeah, I think now we go back to missions. We haven't had anyone say that they need a lot of help. Okay, so we're just over here. Let's take a look at the bulletin board. I've got some tiny. I've got tiny woods. Thunder I've got three hundred thunder wave caves and three and mount steel. four mount steel. You have three. You have. I'm about to do this mount steel. So let me check. I don't currently have any jobs, so I think I'm also going to mount steel. But I only have three of those. All right. Well, I'm gonna accept all these now. Here's the thing. I'm gonna run through these quickly because I don't really need the items right now. Oh, whoa, we should have came back this way first. Oh, don't worry, I'm running that way. I just need to see if I need to accept these immediately. Excellent. Oh, accept you? All right, I'm accepting these two, I guess. Thunder Wave Cave, if something comes up there. <laughs> so real quick, before I uh, get into anything, I'm going to take these drops. And now I'm going to meet you. Could we have ran over <coughs> to it first? I think Maybe so. Maybe it was triggered by Wigglytuff. It was probably. It was probably triggered by Wigglytuff. I don't know, because I walked up the bank here and I was fine, but I walked two steps further. Yeah. Huh? What's going on over there? There seems to be a commotion. Squad! Please help my friend! Please, I need help! Forget it! We're not, we're not about to work for that! But my friend needs a gust of wind, please! Hi, what's going on? Uh, that scene here. Jumpluff's begging for a rescue mission, but not finding any luck. See that guy? There, the one in the middle with the pointy nose. He's a Pokemon named Shiftry. He's got his own rescue team. But his team's greedy. They don't work unless they get paid royally. Jumpluff's been begging for help, but I, I feel sorry for that poor Pokemon. Wait, what, what, oh, 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 what, what do you, what do you want? Oh, it's Alakazam. That's what? Alakazam? <clears throat> hey, rather cold hearted, aren't you? To save Jumpluff's friend, a strong wind is needed. Your leafy fans can whip up powerful winds. It's an easy matter for you. Help that Pokemon out. He didn't even give him a choice. He said, help him out. This is an Alakazam uh. talking to three dark types. And he's bossing them around. What do you think about that? Alex oh, oh, dude, okay. I thought, okay, yeah, this, yeah. This yeah. Alakazam is so powerful. That he's he is... got Focus Blast. <laughs> he's not missing This nothing. is Gen 3. Focus Blast didn't exist. He's got it. He's got Hidden Power Fighting. He's got Focus Blast. Which would be... Yeah. Okay, okay, we'll do it. Oh, he sprinted... I don't think Wish Cash is the... Wow, that shifter agreed without any argument. Say, who are they? What? You don't know? It's Alakazam's team. They're the most famous rescue team around these parts. That's Charizard. His flamethrower can melt mountains. I'm gonna be that one day. <laughs> that, that's Tyranitar. 
He takes great pride in his armored body and amazing strength. And that's the leader, Alakazam. Alakazam doesn't like physical attacks. He fights with his psychic powers. He's endowed with an amazing brain and an IQ of 5,000. Apparently, he's memorized everything that's happened in the world. What? Alakazam does all the commanding of the team. He's clearly in charge. Thank you! No need for thanks. It is only natural that you get help. If anyone turns you down again, come see me. Take care. Cool. I, I wouldn't expect less from a gold rank rescue team. Holes. Uh oh. Oh god. Uh, what's wrong? What's up? It's fine. Nothing. Let's go. Thought I was gonna get a cool Charizard monologue. <sighs> Woo! That was scary, Fish. G cool. You, Domino. We need to become like them. Let's recruit more members and, and make our rescue team first class. Ooh. Not if I can help it. <laughs> oh, stuck out the tongue. What? So now what? The next month. Didn't even get to do any missions. I wonder if that updates the bulletin board, so maybe we'll have like extra. Mount Silver. Mount Steel. Mount, Mount Silver. <laughs> it's pretty far down. Good morning, Dominator. Yes. Okay. Here we go. Let's go check. I'm just gonna go check the. Ooh. I have a Thunder Wave Cave mission in here. And I'm already in Pel at Pelipper. I got Pelipper's lost in this office. dungeon. Somebody help me. Okay, I didn't have anything new over here. I didn't have any. Uh... You didn't have anything new. Uh, real quick, I'm gonna see if there's any I can afford. Nope, that's a lot of stuff. Okay, there. I just have a tiny woods one here. So I'm ready to head off to Mount Steel. I'm not quite ready, but I'm about to be ready to head off to Mount Steel. Let me see what I have more of. I think I have three Thunder Wave Cave and three Mount Steels. Um, what are my rewards for this? Berry Berry, Max Elixir, and 100 Pokey plus question mark? Gravel Rock? Max Elixir plus question mark? Gravel Rock? Max Elixir. All the same, normal beginning yeah, it's stuff. All, it's all about the same, but I don't have to go as far if I do Thunder Wave Cave, so I'm going to take that now. I'm going to do Thunder Wave... We'll make sure that we get a little bit different scenery on different sides. I'll do Thunder Wave Cave while you do... Mount Steel. All right. Since mine's gonna now, be a little shorter. you might notice the layout looks all like Mount Silver right now. <laughs> Since you're gonna take a little bit longer, you have a bigger dungeon, I'm gonna take the time to show off Izzy joining the squad. Izzy's, Izzy's popping with me. Ooh, I can check out my different friend areas if I want. I'm not gonna worry about that right now though. For the domination base. And we'll go check out Thunder Wave Cave. All right, I think I have to get I have to get the entire thing done. I have to go the entire thing, all the way to, to the ninth floor in order to finish mine. I think my Izzy is level six compared to my ten and eleven. So this is a Nuzlocke, right? Uh, so when he dies. Now what I want to know is this lists both things as special abilities, both sturdy and magnet pull. So uh -huh. I want to know. If I get both? Well, honestly, I'm... I don't know how, uh... I can't remember how abilities work. I didn't even know there were abilities until I said that. Did I know there were abilities? I don't know. Uh, come back here, you fiend. What does a, uh... Gravel Rock 4... What's the difference between Gravel Rock 4 and... It's just the amount of Gravel Rock you have in the stack. Does so that mean I can four. throw four of them? Or yep, that means you have four of them in the stack. Okay. So I can throw on four different occasions. Yes. For example. So. How do I do my set thing? I do not remember at all how to throw a set item. And it missed. And, and. and you, is there, I guess there is, because it just showed. Hmm. I definitely had one. 
I definitely did have something set. Okay, so Trico just used Quick Attack through me. Oh, you know what? Yes, that's another thing. Quick Attack can go through people. Ah! I definitely have, um... I definitely have all of set to only ever Ember and never not do a move. Oh, yeah, that's because we had the... The boss battle. That boss fight. Um, so, what was our question of the day? So, our question of the day... What are some quality of life changes in these Pokemon games? This or the main series or whatever Pokemon spin-off games you're thinking of that changed from like game one to game two. Not big mechanic changes like physical special split, but the, the small stuff that makes life easier. I really like in future Mystery Dungeon games uh, how... I like how they made it so that you could toggle through what attacks you want to use instead of just having one set move. You would like hold R and then pick up, down, left, right, and that would be your assigned move. Now it's like I have one assigned move and if I ever want to use another one, it's a struggle to go through the menu. So I think my quality of life change, uh, small feature to improve the game, um, in regular games probably has to be the subtraction of uh the subtraction of hms not having to have a pokemon no cut or flash something like that is just uh, it's great now i know domino doesn't use repels but one of my big quality of life changes was uh being able to when a repel runs out oh just being able to click, yes, I want to renew my repel. Yeah, and all those shiny Pokemon go run away. Yeah. Isn't that convenient? <laughs> I, I, I Catch my shinyless, shinyless run. Yeah, yeah. Unlike me. It's really impressive. Who, if you didn't see it, you should go check out episode 17 of the... Uh, Dang, you remember the number. The Ultra Moon playthrough. Where are my... Where are third floor? Third floor. Third floor. Where, where can I? Trying? Where can I recruit Geo Dude to? That's a good question. Oh, I have, I have found the first. Yes. All right, one down, three to go. How are you coming through yours? Um, about to be one down. And two to go. Cause you had four somehow. <gasps> no. I'm so glad it asks again. Are you really sure? I wish it would be like, hey, you're in the middle. You have some more missions ahead. Is that fixed in, in, in future games? Because that would be my pick. I do I've not reached remember. another destination floor, and there's my target. The fourth floor. Wow, I spawned right here next to mine. Yep. <laughs> so what That's other... Impressive. I'm level 11, finally. What other things are minorly better in games um one thing i i hate how in the pokemon games they always add it like a cool feature and then remove it later right but one of the things i liked about that was like in gen 4 uh big quality of life change was you could just hit the run button just tap it and then you're always running instead of having to hold down b that was fun that was oh, in that was yeah. in heart gold soul silver only oh, <laughs> right, because it had on, on the bottom screen it had the it had the boots picture, yep, the so boots. you could click that. So it would. That's a good one. That's a good one. Um. Hmm. Am I on to the next floor already? Yes, so. Seventh floor. Blasting through. Oh, whoops. Hopefully this pincer can't hit me. Link you spawn me right next to my people who need help. Alright, since... It, just like you were saying, I have to go in here, go to moves, and do all of that just yep. to use Ember. Goodness gracious. It's a... Uh, it's rough. This is the rough cut of these games. And it's still amazing. Oh, it only gets better. Fight me. Your tackle did one damage. Did one? One. Not even a regular attack, a tackle. Okay, I'm gonna take down this Tyrogue and then I'm gonna 
go on to the next floor because I only have one mission left. I'm done with my missions. I just decided to uh, continue running through. All right. I figured up all the apples. Another destination floor. Let's freaking go. Someone just picked uh, up a hurl orb. Does a hurl orb make you hungry? That'd be uh, terrible. I think a hurl orb just tosses. It's like a blowback thing. It pushes the enemy as far back as it until it hits a wall. Gotcha. I could be wrong. That could be the blowback orb. So you're hurling something at somebody, not you're hurling. Yes. It's very different. I was uh, I was unsure. I have found the final mission. <laughs> I almost called him a missionary. He's not a missionary. <laughs> the final I missionary. Found... Found the final mission. Okay. All right. Goodbye, Elkid. No, yes. I'm just gonna collect a couple of final items as I make my way back to the stairs. And then we'll wrap up this episode. Ooh, I'm almost hungry. Can I make it? It's like we're Miranda. at a... Oh, God. That's the thing. <sighs> Aaron and Belden would be really cool to have on your team if they could evolve. Right, but if you can't evolve anything until... Yeah. Post. Which, I guess maybe we don't know that yet, because we're rocking with level 11s. But for those who don't know, you don't evolve in this game. Yeah, so I mean, you, you can't evolve until post-game. Until post-game. And then you can evolve. And so, we're going to be playing that far. Yeah. And I don't know if I've ever gone that gone far. Gone that far? I've never been able to stop before I got to evolve at least my main members. Right. It just feels so... Hey, Trico, can Jeez. you use Quick Attack, my guy? Or you just want to let me get killed real fast? You just want to let me get killed real quick. Okay. I just took a leap of faith. If that thing would have hit me one more time, I would have died. Ooh. Getting dizzy from hunger. Don't worry, Charmander. If you fall over, the stairs are literally right there. So I don't know about you. We'll find out in a second. But I just ranked up from normal rank to bronze rank, which I think is probably the requirement for the next story part. Oh, so I want us to do one day of events. Yeah. All right, well, let me collect my... Let, let's collect what we have here. Five rescue points I went up. Okay, now from Tyrogue, 100 Poke Coins, five... And there it is. There we go. Bronze rank. Let's go. The domination is let's officially go. bronze rank on both the left and the right screen. I think I pointed right and then left. It's cool. Right, left. Left and the right screen. Yes. Something like that. Yeah. I don't know. Apparently I had a max elixir with me that this Pidgey needed. I say no. Didn't Next we do one. good today? Let's call it a night and get some rest. Okay, see. Oh, that was... Okay. I think we'll find out what happened the next morning. Probably in the next episode. Yeah, so there's no dream or anything like that? Okay, I guess it doesn't happen all the time. Anyway, we are going to go ahead and wrap up the episode the right there. The what are you at? Ooh! Oh, I've got 60 points! Ooh, you're a little ahead of me because you had that extra mission. You Let's had that go. extra mission. Let's go. Anyway, in the next episode, we will continue on with whatever is next. Now that we've hit bronze rank, we're probably going to have a special mission of some kind. If you wound up enjoying today's episode, make sure to hit the like button down below and do subscribe to become a member of the Domination. While you're at it, comment the question of the day, which was, what is your favorite small feature that makes the games more convenient in any of the Pokemon games? Let us know in the comments below. Anything else? Just thanks for watching. Of I course. appreciate you people. Thank you so much for the support. And again, make sure you check out the video that talks about our charity live streams that we're going to be doing this weekend so you can join us for that. Until then, spread positivity, be the light, and have a blessed day.